And the sun, I don't know if the sun is affecting my visual. Anyway, today I wanted to do a grocery haul. I had done another grocery, like Christmas grocery haul in December. But imagine someone accidentally deleted the footage. So um, let me do a grocery haul right now of a few items that I have bought. I think this, this is basically our monthly shopping for a family of three. It's just the three of us, <laughs> Alfie, Ayana and I. So um, it's not much, but I wanted to share with you guys my preference of the items that I bought. So let me show you. Ah, let's start. So first of all, I'm going to start with this festive deluxe rolls. I really like them, especially when you're making two hot dogs at home with sausages, fake hot dogs <laughs> with sausages. And then we've got the small pack of the Safari Big sausages. I really like these ones. I don't like the spicy, the spicy sausages. I don't know why. And then I got a small cake for Ayana for her snacking in school. And then we have the buns, burger buns. I hope I'll be able to make a burger one day, like day. I don't know. Let's see. And also, we have this cone. So you guys, among these pastries, I really, really like this. I really like it. And <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to manage to do a no wheat challenge this year because apparently if I'm consuming all this much wheat, there's no way I'm going to lose weight at all <laughs> i don't know anyway let's see and then we got this small soda uh it has an offer what is this um flipping nibble flipping and nibble potato chip sticks lightly baked seasoned with salt and vinegar have you guys seen this brand before for the this giveaway let me open it and then you tell me have you guys seen it and have you tried it as well i don't know you have tried it let's see this is how it looks. I'm going to try it out. I hope it's going to be a new favorite um, snack. It's seasoned with salt and vinegar. Sea salt and vinegar. And then a small soda. Oh, also. <laughs> oh my goodness. We got this on offer. It's buy one, get one free. And then we didn't buy much because if Ayana finds this she really loves it and then it gives her a flu and then for me as well i don't want to get the temptation of eating ice cream in the house so and that's already in the fridge and then i bought um prestige one kg i like i prefer this over um, blue band because it's cheap first of all especially when I'm baking so I don't feel the pinch sana when I want to bake so um, yeah I got this at around how much was this 250 bob and then the 1 kg for blue band is around 380 so if you're a fan of baking this is very economical for you as well so let's see what else do I have here Ungaya ugali obviously um am i going to place this okay my kitchen is so small and then we have more maize for which brand do you guys use 
you I, I used to hear at Hostess is the best brand. I don't know, have you which brand of Nini Maze Club do you guys use? Ebu let me know down in the comment section. And then I topped up one sachet of spaghetti. You can see I still have some more spaghetti over here. So I just um added one. These ones are enough to run us through the month and the hair is misbehaving. Okay. And then I still have more unga. I bought one all-purpose eggs. And then I also have another multi-purpose over here. No, sorry, self-raising. Self-raising flour over there. Oh, and, the, and last but not least, I don't know if you guys have bought this before if you have seen this um peptam offer they give this ketchup for free I, I have some more ketchup over here so i wanted the jam the strawberry jam especially for ayana she's a big fan next here we have a pack of witterbix for the little girl as well obviously so i bought this small pack because i also have this she's not really a big fan of witterbix that's why i just um we buy the small one it runs her through the whole month and then here we have a few snacks numbers crips chips <laughs> what to a ghetto what to a ghetto is this are these crips or chips Q.com mm. Guys, I have been using I have been using um we have been using the babe these are my journeys in a Melvin's oh we've been using the Melvin's Tangawizi and then someone told us that this um brand of tea leaves yeah actually they smell very well when you make the tea so I want to try them out and see. So we bought a small pack so because we want to try them out. I'll let you know how it smells. If if you've used it, I will comment down below and let me know. Also, which is your favorite brand of tea leaves? I'd like to know because I know there are brands that when you cook the tea, they don't even have a scent at all. So maybe if you know <laughs> of a brand of tea leaves that you guys use and it's you know when you make the tea in a Lukia, you feel like you're you're really taking the real African tea. And please, please help a sister. <laughs> Comment down below on the one that you prefer. So here we have Indomie. I am not <laughs> that much of a fan of the Indomie. I bought the Super Mojo or Super Moho. This is also for Ayana. So oh, yeah. Let's see. And then I bought sugar. Cabras is my brand. And the reason as to why I bought these ones in 1 kg each is because of these jars. So at least when I buy a kg, it, it will fill it up to three quarters. So I don't have to have a pack a pack in the in the cabinet that is unsealed or something. So I buy one 1 kg each so that I can top it up when yeah, nuggets. I can talk about when in nature. So over here, I also bought um drinking chocolate sachets. Do you guys buy this can all the time? Do you guys buy this can all the time? The canned one. It will let me know because me, I think this is much cheaper. Because when you buy this, this is around two hundred and thirty-five. This one. And it's 225 grams or 250. Let's say it's 250 bob. And then these ones, you're going to buy them at how much? How many grams are these? Grams is equal happy. <laughs> so this this is 90 grams. Let's say this is uh, so the both of them are about 200 grams, and this is 225 grams. So every time you're buying this, you spend around 250 bob. And then every time you're buying this two, which can fill this one, 
that is about 110 because a sachet goes for 100 goes for 55 bob so basically i have saved half the money for the can so i don't know you can what do you guys do do you buy do you are you always buying um the candle on every now and then because for me i don't next up is this juice Coco pine is our favorite flavor and then, and then of course these ones are on offer they were going for 219 bob the two liter one sorry guys nahepajua it's really <laughs> going directly into my eyes and then fresher milk five two this is five liters two liters ah, okay so this is two liters this is the same as buying how many four packets of milk so this one this this will run us through the whole week so i think we're going to buy another maybe next month next week next up we have this rina uh do you able to help me guys guys let me know do you have a specific brand of cooking oil because i don't <laughs> i have never felt any difference when i'm cooking with different brands like i have never seen any difference in my cooking because i see some people saying they only use fresh fry others say they only use golden fry sometimes rina so for me i basically pick the chief option i basically pick the cheapest option because i have never felt the difference in cooking oil i have never so I, we I, I buy the cheapest option before i was buying the avena avena five liters it was going for around 650 bob in kafo but now it's going for 1k <laughs> who now who <laughs> So I bought the three liters because I still have some more cooking oil here. So these ones will they will run us through the month. I think sometimes we, we do shopping and then I feel like it takes us through one and a half months. So it's like we do shopping such this type of shopping when you do shopping like bulk shop bulk shopping like this instead of taking us through a month they literally take us through one and a half months so in three months we do shopping twice instead of thrice make sense <laughs> we bought these tenor tissues the 10 plus 2 free <laughs> is there anyone else who really goes for do you do you shop for the brand or do you shop for the offers what do you guys do i still have some more tissue over here so this one will probably go to up to three months <laughs> they will go to up to three months for up to three months so let me know do you shop for the brand or do you go for the offers because i feel like i'm a bit specific on a few items and then for others i i prefer going um for the ones on offer so that i can try out um new items for example like this one <laughs> you can get a single a single uh, toilet cleaner is going for around 220 bob and then this one plus this it's going for 235 bob i'll pick this one of course with the free vim hmm? scoring powder with the free scoring powder and then for cleaning I have um, the topics, the white bleach and the color bleach for cleaning. I've never used this before. Actually, this is the first time I'm buying this um, bleach, the colors bleach, because <laughs> someone here, a little girl over here, ate mangoes and then she spilled um, the mango juice all over her dress. So I hi uh, took ease of stains so let me try the jeep color even though i know mango stains are very very tough as it kwango if you have a hack for that it will let me do, know down below kindly kindly because i found myself throwing away um many of her outfits because she's a real she's a big lover of mangoes and then when she eats in a magika kwango so the stains has itoki at all so this time around <laughs> I want to try this i hope it will help if you have a hack please let me know down in the comment section ariel i use ariel no matter how much omo advertises i don't 
I don't use Omo at all. It really, um, it's really tough on my hands when I'm doing hand washing. So I bought this. So we, this one, buy this one, and then get the free half kg. I bought the one kg plus free 500 grams, and then you get to save 170 bob if you are buying the boat because this one is around the half kg is around 170. So when you buy the two, you are basically saving 170 bob. That's a deal for me. <laughs> that is a deal. Mama offers. <laughs> Look at that. I used star soft, but then I changed to this because they have a free sanitizer. So some I, some items I'm not really, really, um, I'm not really specific about the brand. Like the star soft, it doesn't really, it doesn't really affect me that much because you know. <laughs> like the results are still the same maybe for something like hand washing powder and maybe milk but if you took amazing in a cooking oil and etc washing powder i don't have a specific brand i basically buy as per offer and then here we have i'm trying this out for the first time we use yeah. like a small um cup yeah. box ayo <laughs> what do you want Nataka nini? Ku record na mimi. Come. Come and record with me. Go bring your table. You record with me. Um there's this honey. I bought this honey because a friend told me that um if your child is coughing of which she has been really coughing of late, I think it's because of the school. When one child has a flu, you know the whole school has a flu. So she told me um, if I give her like a teaspoonful of honey, it relieves the cough or it helps to reduce the coughing. So I'm going to give this to her. She's allergic to cold. So at night is when she she really, really coughs. So I'm planning to give her this and then I'll let you guys know if it's legit. But I trust her. I know she told me the right thing. And then I bought this um, Nivea Repair. Alfie has been complaining that his hands it's because of using um you know when you're going to different places and then you have to wash your hands the soaps are so different especially when you're moving from office to office so his hands are really cracked so i bought are uh, cracked and dry so i bought this nivea repair and care the small one the small pack for him <laughs> so that he can carry it around i hope he'll carry it i don't know but i know it will help his hands out so now let's go to the groceries let me i've done a few grocery Look at the camera if you want to record with me. <laughs> hey guys so these are the few the, a few of the groceries that i bought um i have already removed the tomatoes from there so i still have a few more tomatoes in the fridge so i bought this i i don't buy much so that because i love freshness <laughs> so um let me show you so i have those tomatoes in the fridge i had these ones you can see the difference remove your hand baby you can see the difference between easy nizakitambo and then we have the fresh one so i don't like stocking too much so that um they, i can maintain freshness on the groceries so i bought these onions at five shillings each akini kubwa look at how big they are <laughs> i bought them at five bob each you see why i i don't shop much on um groceries i prefer to replenish them like every week if possible or maybe every two weeks because you can see this one is already withered <laughs> favorite apple mangoes i just bought two of them and then i i buy fruits daily ah seriously buy fruits is a quicker freshness freshness stuff are these cereals which i'm going to be showing you guys in details when i'm doing the meal prep I was basically topping up um, this one. So I didn't buy any green grams. I still have a lot there. So I added the lentils, rice, wheat flour, and meongeza. I'm just going to replenish the, the jars. And then I also bought um, yellow beans. Yeah. So for the spices, I didn't need to buy any more, more spices because I already have all this. <laughs> I bought the, all this in December. I think they're going to run me for around two to three months. Popcorn in a jar. Popcorns in a jar. Um, what I just bought is the tea leaves. Those ones over there. 
the rest zico they're okay then guys look at this you guys didn't leave this um this um this one here so i've thrown these ones on top here i'm going to arrange them later Ayana, stop pushing me so um I, I think i need to add another rack probably down here or up i think down here up there sit here I'm, I'm too short so I'm, i think i'm going to move this from here and then add another spice rack over here and add more jars because as you can see my uh, chicken masala is here have the tandoori over here mixed spices baking soda what is this this is hibiscus and um turmeric so i don't want this i don't want plastics in my kitchen so i'm going to be doing that with you guys so in case you didn't watch my extreme kitchen makeover there is a detailed tutorial on how you can do this you can go ahead and check it out so and i'm going to be adding the shelf i'm going to let you guys know and i'm going to take you guys shopping with me for jazz Sour. um that's it for today guys i really hope you enjoyed the video if you did please don't forget to give me a big thumbs up comment down below and then i'm going to be seeing you guys on the next video when i'm doing a meal prep yeah yeah the meal prep so um i hope i'm going to be able to share a few recipes um not that much of a chef but i know my way around the kitchen kidogo <laughs> so i'm going to be doing a meal prep on the next video or the video after that so yeah stay tuned if you haven't subscribed please subscribe and then you need to go and check out all my other videos i have a lot of content i have so many videos that you guys haven't watched by the way so many like there's a specific let me recommend to you guys one video if you're feeling down and bored please go and check out the video that i did it's called um the logo challenge the logo challenge it was hilarious hilarious together with how well do i know my hubby check out those two videos and i know you're going to love them sour so that's it for today guys i love you so much and don't forget that jesus loves you more bye Giving a warning, I'm leave without giving a, giving a. But every time we say goodbye.